Hey guys, so it's been a while since I did a video, but I have decided I'm going to do 10 days of 100% liquid diet to reset my pouch. I'll explain why in a minute. But I have everything that I need. I have my Premier Protein. I'm going to put it in this tumbler. I have my water bottle with water in it right now. Um, I have a whole bunch of um, little things. Gonna be, I have better than bouillon for when I need something savory and not sweet. And I bought sugar free jello. So, 18 months post VSG, and I'm gonna go on my 10 days liquid diet again. I have an end goal, so I'll explain that right now. I'm kind of nervous about it, but I'm really excited. I have an end goal for after I'm done. With the 10 days, I am going to set up an appointment um, to have a consultation with skin removal. So I'm excited about that. Um, I talked with my um, surgeon, Dr. Ludwig, yesterday, and he said that um, I should be at or close to my ideal weight goal by two years and that's a hundred pounds away so I I need to reset everything and start again basically so I'm excited I'm a little nervous I'll show you my weight right now so it is January 22nd I'm gonna go with 331 and um, we'll see what it is after 10 days. Day two. Day one was harder than I thought it was going to be, honestly. I am. Um, I don't know. I, it was harder than I thought it was going to be. I have all the stuff that I need, but for some reason it was just challenging. I was at work and. Um, all the ladies in the office for some reason were like, do you want this? Do you want this? And I'm like, no, thank you. I'm on a liquid diet. No, thank you. So <clears throat> then I got home and I could not stop drinking broth and uh, I burnt my tongue. Oh, anyways. So today I woke up and I had my, I take these drinkable probiotic yogurts. So I had one of those and then I am about... Mm, there's much left of this protein shake and it's only 11 so <sighs> I'm gonna go shopping with my family I'm gonna take them to Costco for the first time and yeah I have to get some more protein shakes from my mom's house and hopefully today's just a little bit easier than yesterday <laughs> yesterday it wasn't it wasn't as big of a struggle as the first time I did 10 days but it still was more of a struggle than I thought it was going to be. So, which is kind of stupid. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. I'll let you guys know how it goes. So today is day, still day two. <laughs> I just got back from Costco and that was a struggle. I went with my brother and my boyfriend and um, I never actually like walked around the inside of Costco before. So it was kind of fun just to like look around and see stuff, but oh, they have a bakery there. <laughs> oh my god. So if you watched my previous 10 day video when I first did it right before my surgery, on day three I cooked dinner for my sister and they were um, at the store, they were like barbecuing tri tips or whatever on the outside. <sighs> Today it was baked goods. It was baked goods and it smelled so good. So I got this bone broth. Oh, I'll show you a picture. Hold on. So this bone broth is delicious. I'm eating it now. Um, it's butcher's bone broth. It's chicken. And then I added some sesame oil and soy sauce and spices to it. It's so good. But um, self-imposed 10-day liquid diet. And it is still difficult. <laughs> so, today is day three and I found out yesterday that if you get the apples and cinnamon premier protein and you heat it up, oh my god it's so good. 
it's so good. It's like having the like um, Quaker apples and cinnamon oatmeal and then adding milk to it and then just drinking the milk. It's so good. It's so good. So today's day three. I have some errands that I need to run today and um, it's going to be an interesting day. I hope that it goes about as well as yesterday. Um, yeah, it's not that bad right now. <laughs> so, day three. I was getting ready for bed and I realized I didn't do day four. So, today was day four and it was a struggle again today. I don't remember it being this difficult the first time around. What the heck? <laughs> um, I put on the Facebook forum that of the social group that I belong in and everyone that is doing the 10 day liquid diet again after surgery said that it was harder the second time than the first time. And oh my God, Ugh, I've wanted to give up like three or four times every single day and today's day four. So yeah, it sucks. But um, I went to the store with my boyfriend today. He's so supportive. It's amazing. But I went to the store with him today and we got different kinds of broth. So it's not just all chicken broth. And then I also found some, um, like, like broth soups that have a protein in them as well that I could take to work. So it's not having a protein shake at work. I can have broth. So that's exciting. Um, but yeah, every, I have not cheated. Not once. I haven't, I haven't put anything in my mouth that I can chew. And so I am very, very proud of myself that I could say that because like I said, I have wanted to quit three or four times every single day since day one. So, and it's not even crap. It's like today I really wanted a spinach salad. I just want to eat. <laughs> I just want to eat. I just want to chew it. <laughs> so day four. Okay. So today is day five. I'm liquid diet. Um, I'm actually incredibly discouraged today because I weighed myself at the gym. Either I gained four pounds in four days on a liquid diet, 100% a liquid diet too, I haven't cheated at all, or my scale is wrong. So I don't know what it is but I'm feeling really discouraged today. Um, the sippable things I was telling you about, I wanted to show you. Sippable broth. This one's chicken with ginger and turmeric. It's only 45 calories. Um, it doesn't have, it has nine grams of protein, but then I also have this um, unflavored collagen that I'm gonna put in there. Um, 20 grams of protein to make it 30. Um, but yeah, I'm just really discouraged today. Um, I feel really bummed, so. But I'm sticking with the liquid diet, even though I'm bummed. So, day five, today's halfway through, and <laughs> I'll just keep weighing myself at the gym or at the doctor or something because I don't I, I don't know I, I don't think I'm gonna go with my home my at home uh, scale <laughs> I could not think of that word at all it's seven o'clock in the morning and I have to get ready to go to work but yeah day five Hi, today is day seven. So I forgot to film on six, but day six, um, I went to the gym and I still didn't eat. I was sticking with the um, protein shakes and stuff like that. But um, I, I had, my heart was hurting. So I went to the doctor and the doctor said that um, I pulled a muscle under my chest plate, which I didn't even know you could do. So, um, 
I didn't do anything yesterday. And then when I went to do my video, a tree fell through my neighbor's roof. And nobody called 911, so I did. And um, that was a whole thing yesterday. So I was like, you know what, before I go to work, I'm just going to do day seven so that I can actually do it. So I have my protein shake and I have more of my sippable broth and yeah, I cannot wait for this to get over. I say this every single day, but it is still a struggle and I just, I cannot wait. I don't know what I'm going to decide to eat. It's like my first meal, I'm, you know, after the diet, I, I have no idea. It's kind of like intimidating, you know what I mean? What's the first thing you're going to eat? I think I'm going to eat a salad, but I don't know. <laughs> so today is day eight, and um, I am so excited for this to be over. It's all self-imposed, but for some reason I'm just really excited for this to be over. Um, I, I almost gave up yesterday, but I didn't. So I'm really excited about that. I'm really, really proud of myself for that. Um, what happened was yesterday I was really busy at work. And so the night lunch I didn't get to finish my sippable broth. So I only got like six or seven grams of protein. And um, that was at 11 in the morning. <laughs> and then when I got off at three, uh, I was hungry. And then at 4.30 I was like, you know what? Because I try to set times to eat. So in the morning, I have my morning protein shake at 8. And then I have my lunch at 11. And then I have dinner usually at like 5.30. And I try not to like snack in between. Um, and so I just like drink my water and, you know, stuff like that. So at 4.30, I was like, I'm so hungry. And I had an hour left until dinner. So I screw this it's basically I'm putting myself through you know torture kind of so I just I went to the, the kitchen and I was like forget this and I just opened a protein bar and I was like fuck it and I threw it away and so and then I just had dinner at five so um instead of 5 30 because I almost gave up yesterday. But the fact that I didn't, I'm actually really proud of myself for not giving up. Um, yeah, I knew, I knew that if I took that bite, I would be so disappointed in myself and this whole thing would just be for nothing. So, today is day eight and I only have two days left until it's done. Um, my boyfriend got me a new scale, a new home scale, and it seems to be working. He said that I was 331, which means that I have lost weight um, from when I went to the gym and weighed myself. And then when I went to the doctor uh, on the 20, on the 12th, I'm sorry, when I went to the doctor on the 12th, my weight there said I was 343. So, I must be losing weight because when I weighed myself at the doctor, it said 331 or 332. So, I have to be. <laughs> I'm not eating anything. I'm just drinking everything. So, it's just what goes through my mind. <laughs> um, but yeah, day eight. Yay. So, today is day nine and I am not at home. Um, my boyfriend had a doctor's appointment out of town, so we have been out of town all day. I just had pho broth for dinner, and yeah, I'm about to drive all the way home. <clears throat> it takes about two hours to get home, so I'm so excited that it's almost over. Tomorrow is the last day. Day nine, and I still didn't eat anything. So yesterday was actually day 10. Today will be day 11, but I'm not going any further. <laughs> um, 
I'm really happy that it's over. I, I, I complained every day and I know that I did. Um, I will say that for as hard as it was, it was also very rewarding in the fact that A, I lost 14 pounds and B, I'm just really proud that I made it through the whole thing. Um, that was so difficult, but I did it and I'm so proud of myself. I didn't film yesterday because I had my knees here and it was just, it was too much. So yeah, I just, I'm so, I'm so happy that it's over. <laughs> so yeah, I, um, 10 days liquid diet. Today is Sunday and um, I called a surgeon to set up a consultation yesterday, but it's Saturday of course, so there's nobody, there's no, um, nobody was open. So I'm waiting for a call back, but I'll take you guys on that journey as well. But <sighs> 10 days, <laughs> I made it. <laughs>